Okay, so this video is going to show how to, in Skyward, send targeted emails to families and students. And in this case, we're targeting based on a grade percentage, so a threshold for a grade percentage. Um, this process is a little counterintuitive if you go through a normal flow in terms of the way it's been designed, which is why I thought it um, might be useful to make a little tutorial video. So right now I'm looking at one class's grade book, and I have the screen cropped here um, just to protect student privacy. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go to reports, and then we're gonna go down to email progress report. I'll bring that onto the screen. So email progress report. Right here, we're gonna set up a template. So I have a template that I set up called missing work. So you could say add a new template to start setting up a template. Um, for me, I already have this template set up called missing work, but I'll show you what could happen if we modify the parameters. So we could select our term and then only print, in this case also means email. So only print, so what I'm gonna do is send only print students with less than 85%. What that's gonna allow the report to do is email students and guardians who the student has less than 85%. And then I can choose recipients, guardians, and students. I like to have both. And then I can choose some of these different display options and give a header here. I can do some different um, options down here in these different fields and you can kind of read through those. These are relatively intuitive in terms of picking um, yes, no, in terms of checking those boxes. And then the class comments, um, it's okay to put stuff down here but it doesn't really display very intuitively to the end user when we put a bunch of stuff in the comments. So it's okay, but we're gonna put most of our text later on in this process. So now we're gonna hit save. And then we're gonna hit create emails. So I'm gonna hit create emails. Okay, so this video just got super weird and it's on purpose. Um, what you'll see is a screen coming up next that will show the name of all the students and associated parent observers um, that are associated in Skyward on one column that's kind of over off of the side. Then you'll see that email report is selected for all the students. And this is really the kicker for me that was tough, is that it looks like, why well, it's set a threshold for 85%, not every student is below 85%. Why is every student checked off? And really what this is trying to communicate not effectively, is that these are potential individuals who could be emailed in general. Like it's possible for the system to email them. You're basically adding these students to like the pool that could be then, students could be selected from if they have less than 85%. So we're gonna leave this alone. Even though it looks like you're gonna email all the students, you're not. It's still gonna work. You're gonna just email students who have met the threshold that you set up in your template. So what you'll see is if you go and it's off screen over here, there's a next button. We'll hit the button that says next in the top right corner of the pop-up of the window that pops up. And I'm gonna do that right now. Right here then, this email progress report setup, text of email, this is where you wanna focus on entering the text, any sort of context, directions, links, anything like that. This is the text that the recipients will actually see clearly as an email. So this is really one where you wanna compose your text right here in the enter text of email. And then as counterintuitive as this all seems, you're gonna hit process emails. And even though for me, when I was looking at this, the first time I did it, I was thinking, well, that's gonna email everybody. And then I'm gonna freak out all the parents and they're gonna all think that uh, everybody has, is falling behind in the class. It's not, it's only gonna email the students and parents who you've selected in your template, despite kind of the complicated user interface here and the lack of communication on the part of Skyward. If you hit process emails, it will process and only send emails with the text you've added here to the recipients that you intended. And then you can also view a report. So after you hit process emails, there'll be an option to display the report and you'll be able to click and see just those students and parents who have been emailed. Hope this is helpful. Let me know if you have any questions.